Embedded in a chloroplast's thylakoid membrane are many photosystems. Each is surrounded by an array of light harvesting complexes. Pigments in these complexes can intercept photon energy arriving from any direction. To keep things simple, we'll show just one of the many light harvesting complexes near each photosystem. Photosynthesis begins when photon energy is captured by light harvesting complexes and passed to photosystem 2. The photon energy causes photosystem 2 to lose electrons. It replaces them by pulling electrons from water molecules, which then split into oxygen and hydrogen ions. Oxygen diffuses out of the chloroplast, but hydrogen ions are left behind in the thylakoid compartment. The electrons from photosystem 2 enter an electron transfer chain and continue on to photosystem 1. As electrons are transferred along the chain, hydrogen ions are shuttled across the thylakoid membrane and accumulate in the thylakoid compartment. Hydrogen ions flow back into the stroma through ATP synthases. The flow of ions through these membrane proteins drive the attachment of inorganic phosphate to ADP to form ATP. Like photosystem 2, Photosystem 1 is activated by photon energy passed from adjacent light harvesting complexes. Electrons from Photosystem 1 pass to an intermediary molecule, then to NADP, which also picks up hydrogen ions to form NADPH. The ATP and NADPH formed by this non-cyclic pathway are later put to use in the sugar-synthesizing light-independent reactions in the stroma.